Happening today, Nueces County Commissioners will meet and approve a contract to begin the demolition of Bob Hall Pier. Yeah, Sunrise reporter Victoria Butlerama is live in studio with the project's timeline and cost. Good morning, Victoria. We're moving forward with this. Yeah, that's right. And if approved at today's meeting, the agenda shows Russell Marine LLC out of Houston will be contracted to complete the demolition at a cost of just over $2.9 million. Brandon McNeil, the president of Russell Marine, says he expects to be a officially awarded the project and released to start the demolition of Bob Hall Pier during today's meeting. Once this happens, he says the plan is to have crews working around the clock. I'm told 40 to 50 people will work on the demolition for an estimated four to five months. Start demoing the concrete panels off the top and then start removing the caps and pile and uh, working our way out to the old T head that's completely co collapsed and then we'll use divers and our crane bar just to remove the items that are on the bottom out there. A lot of work ahead of them and McNeil says the biggest challenge will be dealing with high tides. He says the company is also working on plans to ensure all crew members are safe during demolition. The commissioner's court is scheduled to begin at 830 this morning at the Noises County Courthouse. Reporting in the studio, Victoria Bal for Six Sunrise.